So how to put a needle back into a Badger 360. Uh, I've had this gun for a while. It's been really fun. But a lot of it has to do, and I'm trying to do this. There we go. Um, once you get the spring and the trigger in the right spot, I mean, the spring's kind of floating when you, before you put the needle in. I'm not going to pull the needle all the way out. But, but you got to have that movement. The spring uh, brings the trigger back. And it has to do that. And the needle goes through both of them. So once you have that, you've got to seat this. like that see it's on the on the spring there it's kind of a D shaped and it matches the D shape of that so once you get that then you just screw it in and it should work <laughs> this is, yep so far so good It's not easy. Um, I've done it <laughs> a couple hundred times. But there we go. Super smooth. Spray, pull, air, pull, air, pull. So, I know it's, a, it's really hard <laughs> to take these things apart. But um, what I've been doing is uh, cleaning these things with um, gun cleaner. And once you do it like a deep clean, I mean, after you're done spraying, um, obviously you're going to put the, uh, the, the sprayer through there and, and clean it. But um, I take the tip and just soak it in. The gun cleaner and it gets rid of everything and once I put it on I probably wipe it off a little bit super smooth And you can get rid of the gun cleaner by just spraying a bunch of uh, solvent, not solvent, uh, but uh, airbrush cleaner through there. But man, the gun cleaner works, and that's how to put one back together. It's frustrated me forever. But uh, I can't wait to try it out.